All right, just about done cooking this steak up. That's not what this video is about. I'm gonna cook a goose egg with common yard debris sticks. And if you don't already know, this is a brand name Silver Fire Rocket Stove. And uh, that's my stick pile over there, so you can tell I got enough fuel. Let's get, get this get this gone. Get this stick out of here. Because we gotta crack a goose egg. And a little bit tough in chicken eggs. This is good fat and spices. So right here is a goose egg. Got it fresh off of my friend's ranch. She gave me three this time. But they were covered in goose crap and feathers and, and crap. Uh, so she said, make sure you cook them good because there's salmonella. So and they're unfertilized, so hopefully uh, uh, won't be any weird things coming out of this other than egg yolk. So let's crack this sucker open and get it cooking. And let's make sure the fire's still going. Yep, yeah, still going, still going off the sticks. These are common sticks, tree branches and crap. Nothing special. Only thing special is I put a. It's too hot to touch. I put an old stove uh, cast iron plate there. The three three uh, piece set where keep some of the smoke off of the uh, cast iron ware. So anyway, let's let's break this open and do it. Set this down for a sec. This old phone here. I used to be able to break, break uh, eggs with one hand. My little bit of practice, those were chicken eggs. So I don't want to spoil it. Right. Try to set you down with somewhat of a good view. I don't know what you got. So I'm breaking the egg right now. All right, you see that? I don't know if you do. That's a goose egg right there. It's a lot bigger. I'll throw those eggshells out for now. For that. Now I forgot to get a spatula or something. I just have to grab a scrub with a stick. It's pretty hardcore. What do you think? You know, it doesn't seem like there was too much egg in that one. I, I don't know. Am I crazy? There wasn't a whole lot of egg in that egg. What's going on? Well, I think that's cooked. You know what? I'm going to wash off my other two eggs. I can get them cooked up too. Maybe it dehydrated real quick. I don't know what. If that worked out the way I wanted. Hmm. Put the egg stick up in there so it cooks. Cooks away to nothing. It's too hot to hold. Get me a piece of paper. Grab that. Grab that handle there. You know, I'm just going to get those eggs right quick and throw them on there. Hold on.
All right, I'm back. I tried to wash these off pretty good, but the main thing is to cook them, right? Okay. We need to add some more fuel to the fire here. Luckily, I have some sticks ready to go. So one thing you should do if you get a hold of one of these is get some sticks pre pre done up. Kind of experiment with these center blocks, about two dollars a piece. Stick them in a little hole there, ready to go. All right, we got our flame up. Let's see. Yep. Yeah, okay. Got our eggs ready. All right, let's, let's break these suckers. Wish there was a way I could prop this to show you what's going on. These are branch fresh and they got a little bit of dookie on them or whatever. I washed most of it off. Hopefully it'll cook, we'll be all right. Center block makes a good thing to crack these eggs against too. There we go. Let's stir that sucker up. Grab one of these any old sticks here. I know that's been sanitized. Got smoke coming off of it. Yeah, don't be worried about a little wood ash. It's got some good, good stuff in there for you. Feels like the fire's getting low. Get some, get some more fuel on there. The manufacturer says you use this size. It fits in that little measuring device right there, but get a hold of the bigger sticks as the fire gets stronger than her thing got some good flame going so yeah once you pay for this device the silver fire rocket stove called the silver fire survivor and you got enough sticks which most people do you are a free cooking person that's some free cooking right there. Now, in bad weather, rain, stuff like that, a little difficult to use outdoors. But nice, good weather like we got. Birds are tweeting and stuff. Not a problem. Mm -hmm. Let's get that fire nice and hot because I want to be done with this before the video is out. It has been cutting short lately. Make sure that fire's hot so I don't get salmonella. Get another stir stick here. Did you know I was an army cook once? They cook with diesel, electricity, and um, they 
natural gas. I don't cook with sticks. I think this is a lost art to the U.S. Army. Unless there's some sort of outfit out in the middle of nowhere with no other alternative. But it's still effective, I'll tell you. At least for individual type of cooking. Of course, there's a lot of eggs. It did cook down a bit. I, I wonder what's going on. I don't remember that. I've never cooked scrambled eggs in cast iron pan. Maybe they cook, cook down real quick. Maybe I like the hydrated eggs. Maybe it's just an optical illusion. With my steak and corn. A lot of steak and eggs here. Using a worthless stick pile. That's what I call free energy free energy right there, you know what I'm saying? Free stick energy. One guy I was watching on YouTube, he was saying, wood is just a battery, and that is a fact. How's our batteries doing down there? See, it's all about conversion. You convert something you don't want into something you do. Something that doesn't benefit you to something that does. Everything is about conversion everything that's a secret the open secret if you got the material and the technology to convert things you can convert something that isn't much to something that is that's just me talking and cooking alright so this looks done more or less in my long experience doing this which isn't very long but I just don't want to get salmonella or cook that out whatever's in there stir it up real good let it sit for a sec and then we'll be good to go go eat this Mmm, light and fluffy. I should add some milk. Darn it. Oh well. I'm sure it'd be nice, nice with that steak fat in there. Mm-mm. If I had some potatoes and stuff, I'd be hooked up. Alright, so I just wanted to show you about cooking a goose egg <laughs> with sticks. Uh, you know, if... Uh, the old president hooks up with all these warmongers and we have a big uh, exchange of horrible things. Might be everybody cooking with sticks. If they're lucky. Oh, there's an eggshell. So, just something to think about. Alright, this, this is a device will run you around $300, but it's well spent. Because for all the nice weather, you got free cooking going on. As long as you got a little dry wood and things like that. As you can see, it goes through it pretty quick. But you're getting your you're getting your sticks worth. Yeah. Don't want to stick your hand in there. I'm getting hungry, so uh, I better get get done here. How you shut it off? Just let the sticks burn out. Close it up. Put itself out. Just keep an eye on it though, if you want to be safe. But so far, so good. I haven't had any sparks flying, catching fires on different stuff or anything. It's a pretty well safe unit. As you can probably surmise from me running around trying to get the eggs ready. Trying to wash them real quick. Those nasty situations on those eggs. Eggs are great. What they were buried in wasn't that great. But I got them for nothing. Just being friendly. 
and I can appreciate appreciate that sure enough all right um, we'll call it good the big old pieces of egg in there I don't not quite sure what that's about I didn't get to scramble it fast enough not sure maybe they were dry I don't know just want to make sure they're cooked real good because you do not want this to make your person sick namely me okay how we doing flip the stick to open this up maybe I, yeah I'm discoordinated here discord dis discombobulated uncoordinated oh, got all right I gotta learn how to edit my videos top of a bunch of other things I still gotta do my taxes for 2017 you know what I would just wish they'd take the money and be done why do I gotta do paperwork you know why you take money that you gotta pay back? It's ridiculous. Just do a flat tax. Five percent to state, five percent to federal. We're done. That's sales, flat sales tax. We're done. See, that's the way you do it. If you don't buy anything, you don't pay tax. See? I don't buy those sticks. <laughs> know what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? Maybe I'm just a little, this is hungry talk, me getting aggravated I won't eat this, but I don't dare eat it one second before it's cooked. I think it's well enough cooked. These are the, these are pretty good. Okay, well, I'm going to enjoy this. See, what I'll do is I'll put this steak, oop. I don't want this egg on this here. Tracking garments and crap. Ooh, that's hot. Stick that up in there. Clean itself. Like a self cleaning device. Anything dirty, you just burn it. I'm just gonna put the stick right back on there. Doesn't that look good? Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Well, thanks for spending a little time with me. A little randomness. Thank you very much and uh, enjoy your summer 2017. Cross your fingers.